What is diabetes? With diabetes such an epidemic today, it is essential that you know exactly what it is. Why? Well, to prevent getting diabetes yourself that is. In layman terms, diabetes is the inability of the body to process sugars properly. When we eat or drink, our pancreas produces a hormone called insulin. Insulin is released into the blood and helps to regulate the amount of glucose in the bloodstream. Diabetes is a condition where this process does not function correctly. The reason why diabetes occurs is because no insulin is being produced and requires the sufferer to use insulin injections, or insulin is produced but the body becomes resistant to it. This renders the insulin ineffective. This is normally called type 2 diabetes and is rapidly becoming more common. The danger is that while diabetes is not immediately life-threatening the long-term effects of high blood sugar can be damaging to one's health. Uncontrolled diabetes and prolonged, high blood sugar levels can, in later life, cause problems to many organs including the kidneys, eyes, nerves and the heart. This may sound grim, however, controlling blood sugar by a combination of medicine, diet and exercise will vastly reduce the long-term complications. Recent research shows that 2 in every 100 people have diabetes. Alarmingly half of these people do not even know they have it. Many people have diabetes without being aware of it because someone with diabetes looks no different from anyone else. How do you find out if you have diabetes? The simplest way to check if you have diabetes is to arrange a blood sugar check with your doctor. A tiny sample of blood, obtained by pricking a finger is checked using a small electronic tester. A normal blood sugar level is generally between 72 to 126 mg per deciliter or 4 to 7 millimoles per liter. If the body is unable to keep the blood sugar level within these limits, then diabetes is diagnosed. Diagnosis of diabetes can occur out of the blue during a routine checkup but more often it follows from the sufferer experiencing the symptoms of diabetes. These symptoms can be many or few, mild or severe depending on the individual. Common diabetes symptoms. Loss of weight. Glucose is the form of sugar which is the body's main fuel. Diabetics cannot process this properly so it passes into the urine and out of the body. Less fuel means the body's reserve tissues are broken down to produce energy with a resultant loss in weight. Thirst. Often it seems no matter how much you drink your mouth still feels dry. The problem is compounded before diabetes is diagnosed by sufferers drinking huge amounts of sugary drinks. Of course this only increases the blood sugar level and leads to increased thirst. Urinating more often. Sufferers need to urinate often and pass large volumes each time. In addition this symptom takes no account of time so sleep is constantly disturbed by having to visit the bathroom during the night. It is a mistake to think this is caused by the increased thirst and drinking more. On the other hand, high sugar levels in the blood spill over into the urine making it syrupy. To counteract this water is drawn from the body causing dehydration and therefore thirst. If you have experienced any of these symptoms it does not necessarily follow that you are diabetic however it might be advisable to visit your doctor to be sure. If it does turn out that you have diabetes please do not panic. It can come as a shock and it will mean some changes in your life. While it is incurable it can be treated so the long-term complications are reduced or even eliminated. 7 Steps on How to Prevent Diabetes Diabetes is more prevalent than ever and 95% of cases diagnosed are type 2 diabetes. Although for some the development of diabetes is inevitable, perhaps due to hereditary and other factors, for the vast majority it can be prevented by taking these 7 simple steps. Number 1. If you are overweight you risk developing diabetes. Reduce the amount of food on your plate so you gradually eat less and start to lose weight. Drink a glass of plain water or a sugar-free drink before your meal to take the edge of any hunger pains. Number 2. Reduce the amount of fat you are eating. Grill or bake foods instead of frying. Use low-fat spreads and reduced fat meals. Number 3. Check the glycemic index of the food you are eating. Knowing what each food contains helps maintain your blood sugars, which in turn can prevent the full onset of diabetes. Number 4. Drink at least 8 glasses of water every day. If you keep a bottle of water with you and sip frequently you'll be surprised how much you do drink throughout the day. Number 5. If you are feeling peckish choose a healthy snack rather than a chocolate bar. Number 6. 
use skimmed rather than full fat milk in hot drinks and finally number seven exercise is good for health but if you are not used to exercise then start in moderation 15 minutes gentle walking each day will ease you into a regular exercising pattern all of these action points are also the ones that diabetics are advised to take if you take them now you might possibly prevent irreparable damage to your health treatment of diabetes nowadays diabetes treatment has become a common disease among people it is caused due to mismanagement of carbohydrate metabolism inside the body diabetes is identified with the excessive production of urine hunger thirst and excessive loss of weight blurred vision and delay in healing of skin repeated infection and excessive fatigue diabetes has got a serious issue of human health it denotes sugar in blood and urine very excessively so when it comes to treatment of diabetes the main concern should be given to control blood sugar which is main cause of diabetes managing blood sugar is the stepping stone of this diabetes treatment program to remove the complications of diabetes one must take it seriously and adopt some good diet process or healthy exercise apart from doing so some take insulin and any other type of medication program to be cured to some extent Frequent testing of blood sugar can denote you how much you have improved on your part to manage suitable measure of sugar in blood. It is very important to learn the right range of glucose in blood unless and until you cannot have the idea about the complication you are facing about this disease. It depends on age mainly such as in younger age assuming not much complication as there the suitable range of glucose is 80 to 120 mg per deciliter and in older age it is 100 minus 140 mg per deciliter. Diabetes program includes some specific self-treatments like having good and suitable diet, having proper exercise, maintaining healthy weight and medication. When it is about good and suitable diet it does not make any suggestion to take all dull food which are not of your interest rather it denotes to have more fruits, vegetables and grains that means you should be conscious in taking the foods of high nutrition and lower fat and calories. Avoid taking sweets and animal products with no limit. The main part of this diabetes treatment program is that you own self should be challenging in this task otherwise this program will be harder enough. Consult any dietitian about meal plan and try to maintain it at the fixed times every day with same amount according to your diet plan. On the part of having proper exercise you should be cautious about all aerobic exercises. In this diabetes treatment program you can make your choices among the daily exercises like doing morning or evening walk, jogging, hiking, biking, swimming and any other exercises of heart and lungs. Remember giving consistency to your exercise process is very important to get the best result through it. Try to maintain weight according to your activity level and age because overweight is dangerous factor which help to make your cells more resistant to insulin. Making suitable weight loss plan and going according to that can make its result more effectively. Sometimes medication takes a very important role in case where it is found that good dieting and exercise are not fulfilling its purpose. This type of diabetes program includes the insert of insulin as per requirement. As it can't be taken in form of pill some people have it injected by syringe or some have it with insulin pump. So now it is very clear that diabetes is always manageable if the sufferer give a serious daily attention to it. Although diabetes stands for lifelong suffering, yet it never means the end of your life. You just have to remember that the disease will be in your control only and only if you are self-disciplined for your each and every step of treatment program. And that will be it for today. See you guys tomorrow with another exciting, health tip video. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon to receive instant updates on our videos.